building this 90 page booklet. <laughs> um, a lot of research on this site uh, and project, and so if you have any questions, feel free to look through here. Also, I have a small little booklet of just my main project. So Please I'll go closer. Yeah, I've seen it here. Um, so I'll just orient you to my boards. My master plan's over here. Some conceptual drawings are down here. I have uh, my equestrian facility, my recreation center, a residential plan, conceptual design, uh, what it might look like. Here's just a blow up of my recreation center and uh, equestrian facility. They're close to each other, so easy access. And um, my organic farm and covered show arrangement. So does anyone have any questions? How did you choose this area? Um, actually, it's a real site, and I have a real client. Um, his name is Chris Allen, and he his development company is called uh, Stillwater Development. Um, basically, when I was choosing a uh, senior project, um, I heard about all the problems, and I'm a problem solver, and I was like, wow, that sounds really fun. Um, <laughs> can I help out? And he said, yes, please, because they're not moving along far enough. So I've been working with Chris Allen uh, on this project, and uh, we'll get the book list at the end. Oh, Feel question. Ask okay. <laughs> I'm really excited. I want to tell you all about it. <laughs> now, your client was going to show up today, but he has. Uh, he has a multi-million dollar deal to make today, so. <laughs> and I figured that's probably a little more important. But he's seen this throughout the whole process. He'll get a booklet, and uh, I'm uh, well acquainted with him, so he'll get my posters at the end anyways. When does construction start? Um, I don't know. Uh, as soon as it gets approved. <laughs> but he's, we're working with the uh, landscape architect up in um, Reading and uh, giving him they're really excited about their organic farm. They like them a lot. Are there riding trails on these things? Um, property? Yes. Uh, there are some proposed um, horseback riding trails. Um, so, I mean, basically, I want people to be able to ride out their front door if they really want to. So we can keep our horses on our own property? Um, if you want. <laughs> but I think we, I would definitely have to think more about like owner, homeowner association rules and regulations and how to facilitate that. And how much the gardeners are going to make. <laughs> <laughs> what was the most challenging aspect for you? Um, definitely the road design. I know it doesn't sound like a lot, but oh my gosh. Okay, there are tons of waters of the U.S. on this site, and each time you cross, it's a lot of money, it's a lot of mitigation, and nobody likes it. So. Um, Placing my road, trying not to cross the waters of the U.S., plus getting all the percolation sites right, because I have a map of, you know, the most, they're the best sites for percolation, all the way to the, the worst sites, but they're still kind of okay um, to put my homes, and trying to match up my road with those sites was definitely the most difficult. So you guys should look at the road. <laughs> <laughs> Any other questions? And have you estimated about how many home sites there would be? Um, right now, I think there are 35. Um, in my initial project, uh, my midterm review, I had 50. Um, but then I had to restart this quarter because my um, client decided that he thought it would probably be best for each of the homes to have their own leach field rather than building um, a whole water treatment facility. How much land is on each home site? Um, an acre? Or? Each house has about three acres. Around three acres. Home. No, that's good. So they're far enough apart. So they're. I can see, but I can't hear you. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. Does, does each home have its own line for their horses? Um, it's suggested in this like conceptual residential section. I have one. Um, I didn't quite decide. I guess you could say it's lot of information that has to go through that lots of processing. So it's proposed. There's enough room on each site, and uh, it's something to think about more. If no other questions, we have next presentation. Okay. Thank Sorry. you for your time.